Hi, it's still Saturday. I decided to just sit here and, and talk for a few minutes in the middle of the night. Well, not the middle of the night, I think it's like 11. Tomorrow when I wake up, I get to start drinking all of my uh, fluid for my endoscopy on Monday. Like I said, said or if I, I don't know if I said it, but I, I've never had any of these tests before. And to go from never having had to do any of this to have to do it all in just like, what, a month, two months, is, it's wild to me. I feel like I'm living in a completely different world. Um, I just had to drink all that horrible stuff for the CT. And, you know, I'm sure you all know what that's like, but... And now I have to drink like three times that. <laughs> I know. They have to look at it. We need this data for the transplant team. I know. I understand. I hate it. I hate all of it. <laughs> of course. I hate all the little fat deposits, the cholesterol. They're leaving on my face. I hate the constant feeling that I, I may not wake up. I hate. Every little pain now is, is, is that, is that a varicy bursting? Do, you know, and, and uh, I, uh, there's an, obviously I hate it. Who wouldn't? Um, a friend came over today and we had a nice long discussion about health and, uh, um, and, uh, emotions and stuff and. It's hard because I've had friends who uh, who were dying of cancer and they were like, I just can't relate to other people anymore and I'm starting to understand what that's like because you don't have any clue until you go through it. The fear and, the, and just how it's constant. But... I know for PBC, I have to, like, I still haven't gotten it where it rolls off my tongue. I still have to think about it for a second. I know for PBC, transplant prognosis is excellent, but it's still a transplant. It's still anti-rejection drugs forever. It's still no immune system. And to go from nothing ever to that is... I think if I had a better PBCP, I might have somebody to talk to. Um, and referral of some kind. Uh, my gastroenterologist is, is, is great. She's, she's patient with me. I didn't take it seriously at first. She's, she, she, she's kind, but she's, she's not my PCP and she shouldn't have to be. Um, I had to go to urgent care to get my cholesterol drugs because my PCP wouldn't prescribe them and neither would my gastroenterologist but so the urgent care doctor was a little bit angry on my behalf which I I appreciated he uh he was the first and only doctor who looked in my eye and said it's gonna be rough but you're gonna be okay and I think of him as an angel for that I'm scared. I'm angry. I'm sad. I'm grateful because that there have been a few people that, a few key people during this process that have actually saved my life. For instance, I have a friend who worked at the gastroenterologist and she got me in. You know, you can't get an appointment with anybody for months now, anywhere, um, especially a specialist. So she saved my life. My brother saved, my brother, my donor saved my life. 
will will be saving my life, you know. My roommate takes me to all of my things. She's saving my life every day, all the, all the stuff she's doing. I can't even, th there's just no way to even express that. But at the end of the day, I'm still here, still wondering, how long do I have? How is my quality of life going to be? And even if... And even if I do wind up at the end of the journey with a new liver. What will it be for me then? I'll never be able, will I be able to go to India? Maybe not. I can probably still go to England, maybe. Planes, I don't know. Especially in this time of COVID, like, vaccines, what? I can't have live vaccines, like, what the fuck? Sorry, I, I don't want to curse too much on this. It's already been six and a half minutes, and I'm just sitting here talking, so I'm going to stop. Um, thank you again to everybody who's watching, and for all of your kind comments. I, I read them all, I'm still a real old lady with this site. So I, I, I'm pretty technologically savvy, for the most part, but... Um, social media and meme. But I'm getting there. Um, so, so thank you. It means a lot. Just little pricks of light in the darkness. I will do another video tomorrow. I'm probably drinking all the... I forget what it's called. You, you know what it is. Have a good night.